Hey there everyone and welcome back to Google Guru. So today's video is going to cover something that I think most of us do every day or at least on a frequent basis and that's sending ourselves emails as reminders or to-do lists. So this video is going to cover a few of our favorite topics and tools inside of Gmail. So if you need some help getting started I've included some links to additional videos on the page on Google Guru. So if you're like me and you have a great idea or you need to remind yourself to do something but you're away from your computer and you can't get to it at the moment, a lot of times what I do is send myself an email from my phone so I know I'll check it in the morning because my Gmail inbox is something that I always check every single morning so I know I won't miss it. So this is you know, a, a really easy way to stay on top of things and if you're always checking your Gmail inbox is a great tool to use. So what I'm going to show you today is a way to take this process even further by adding some additional functionality. So first off, we're going to compose a message like we normally would. So I'm going to click Compose and send this message to myself. Now the important thing here is to give this message a subject that you're going to be using frequently. So in this case, I'm going to use these self messages in the form of a to-do list. So I'm going to give this subject a matching title. So I'm going to say to do colon. And then from there I can add whatever I want. Sometimes my message will only be in the subject and I won't really have anything in the body of the message. So I'm going to remind myself to record a video tomorrow. And in the body I'll just type NM for no message. So I'll go ahead and send that. So as you can see here, this message appears right here in my inbox. And you know, it's right there at the top, so it's easy to get to. But if you're receiving a lot of messages every night and in the morning your inbox is kind of flooded, this may get lost and you may not actually get to it until later in the day and you might forget about it and it may not actually get done. So next what I'm going to do is set up a Gmail filter for messages like this. So I'm going to open up the message and click on this drop down here on the right side of my screen and click filter messages like this. So obviously the from field will be guru at guruvideos.com and the subject is going to be those keywords that I specified earlier. So I'm going to say to do colon and then create a filter with this search. So this is going to take any message that matches that criteria and I'll be able to take an action on it with this Gmail filter. So what I want to do here is apply a label that will make the message stand out more. So I'll click apply the label and now I'm going to want to create a new label. So this is something that's going to appear in my label list on the left side of my screen along with inside of my Gmail inbox. So I'm going to make it stand out a little bit more. So I'll say to do list and create. So whenever a message has this criteria, it'll be applied the label to do list. And I can add a little bit more features to it if I want. I can always mark it as important or anything else like that. And as you can see here, I have a few other messages that match that criteria. So I'm going to click that checkbox and then create the filter. So if I click on this label here, this is going to take me to all these messages with that label. So next what I want to do is switch from this default inbox view to the priority inbox view. This will give this to-do list label even more exposure inside of my Gmail inbox. So I'm going to click on the settings here and then settings, inbox, and then I'm going to switch from default to priority inbox. So I'll leave my first section as unread, but for this new section, I'm going to click on options and then more options and select this label that I just created. So I'll go scroll down and find the to-do list label. So this will take any message with the to-do list label that comes in as unread and create a separate inbox inside my priority inbox. So it gives a lot more exposure to this to-do list label. So I'll save my changes. And as you can see here, all of these to-do list messages appear right here in my Gmail inbox. So whenever I open it up in the morning, I can see these right here first thing. So I can, you know, as I'm going, make sure that I get all of my to-do items done. So that's how to turn your Gmail inbox into a to-do list. Like I said, this pairs together a few different features like Gmail filters and labels, as well as priority inbox. So if you're interested in learning more about those, please check out the rest of our videos on those topics. If you guys have any questions about setting up a do list inside your Gmail inbox, please leave us a comment in the section below the video. Thanks.